Guys, it's super windy today. Uh, I don't know how well you're going to be able to hear. My uh, machine's acting up. Didn't want to cycle on, so I have to factory preset it, and it barely came on with the factory preset. So I guess I can go through my functions with you. I run Beach 2, ground balance, or er, noise cancel real quick. Ground balance zero. Turn the volume all the way up. Uh, threshold I run at 12 with these headphones. Recovery speed, that's actually pretty good for today. And I wanna go back to the tones, hold the tones down. The low tone factory preset's always low on that volume for the grunts. Turn that all the way up. That's it. All metal always. Just as I anticipated, uh, you can see the wind brought the tide all the way up here. And you can see this black line right here, this black uh, sand right here. Right? So that's the heavy black sand. Anything's going to be sitting in these little loops all the way up through. Usually, if the waves come up this high, whatever was in the white sand just sits in the white sand. It doesn't get washed back out. Anything below this line right here will get washed down to a coin line. So wish me luck. Not something good it's a penny and I want to point out that I'm scanning so I got the sensitivity at 22 and you guys remember what I said about being able to turn the sensitivity up right when you get it up you can run it a higher than the ground and then your scan patterns higher no need to overlap and then when you come into an area, it sounds like there's a lot of targets. Slow down and overlap. Do circles. Do crisscrosses. Do whatever seeks your fancy. Twenty-three, twenty-six. I hear a grunt in there. Now I hear like all grunts. through 26 out of the hole. It's a dime. I'm hearing something else too. It sounds weird. Oh, it's a penny. That's why I heard something else. Good spot for it though. So you guys didn't see me dig that, but Coin and coin, right in a line already. That's a deep dime, that's good. It's an 11, it's a bottle cap or something. I definitely heard the bottle cap grunts, but it's a 10, 11 guys, so really can't leave a 10, 11. All right, guys, I just dug up a bullet sinker. At least I hope that's what those things are called in the shape of a bullet with a hole through. They look like a bullet. So I dug up one of those bullet sinkers right there. It was the number 12. I got a number 12 right next to it. I'm assuming, I'm just assuming it's the same thing. There we go. Is that what that's called or is that sort of some sort of uh patrick from spongebob squarepants head sinker or something like that i don't know <laughs> all 
another 12 another one of those sinkers but it's a 12 you can't leave a 12 oh i just saw it another spongebob square pants sinker so imagine somebody lost a pack of those up here on the beach right and it got washed down so you got to kind of you know pay attention to where the sinkers are sitting so it really sucks when coins when coins are that deep Yeah, it really sucks when coins are that deep. Rings will be deeper. So it just tells you when you find a coin line, if it's deep, slow down because the rings are going to be somewhere right around there. But deeper. Super loud 20. Sounds like a sinker, it's so loud. Somebody asked me if, uh, the volume on the targets is the same and the answer is no in a short fashion generally I can tell the size difference by how loud it is almost look I'm scanning I keep the coil above the ground so that my circle for my detector is this big that's how big the circle for the detector is it doesn't just shoot straight down right so so when I scan you're scanning a larger area if it's right on the ground that's how big your scan is right that big there but if you keep it up sensitivity 22 I do this right here I'm scanning for sounds. This is what the, the, the gold the cherry pickers do on the beach, guys. The guys that just want the fresh drops. Sounds like a couple of them. That was weird. It sounded like I heard multiple sounds. Oh, I picked up the dirt that looked like the quarter. <laughs> Somewhere in there is a quarter. she blows and there's uh there is clearly a coin line oh there was more than one quarter in there thought i heard something else in there what what <laughs> quick 50 cents gotta love that sinker guys this sound is so loud and wide really weird
Oh, I should have known that's what it was. Capri Sun. Nickel. Super loud, 15, 16. Clean. An egg weight. Well, looks like I gotta get the GoPro 9 because these batteries on these 7s and 8s are horrible. The 7s are just unbelievable. I'll put a full one in and three minutes later it's dead. So I'll trade in the 7 for uh, for a 9 and they'll give you $100 off the price of the new one. So we'll have to see how that goes. I'm gonna try out the new nine, I guess. Give it a review. It was a two, three. like a butterfly maybe a little brass butterfly very cool that was a two three guys I found gold yesterday I found a tooth so I'm two days in a row with gold let's see. let's pray for gold today Go get it. <laughs> guys I just picked this up on the beach and this young lady right here from North Carolina, I saw her coming back and I knew what she was looking for. It's like some one of those things that you, you have to pick up, especially if you're an artist or if you're a tourist for sure. I'm gonna find more of these in my life. I've seen them, but I've seen them living, not dead like this on the beach. So I was gonna keep it, but what's your name? Oh, Kristen, thank Chris, you. Kristen came back, her husband told her to come running back and grab it. So <laughs> there you go, Kristen's husband right there. Awesome. So I'm Vermont Derek. Just make sure you look me up and right. subscribe if you yeah, would. I'll definitely read yeah.
Sounds like a couple sounds. Huh. I see the quarter. It just sounded like a couple sounds. More than one sound is what I'm saying. Pretty cool looking patina on that quarter, huh? <laughs> Look at that. Guys, it's trying to rain. Spitting on me. There's a six at the top of the beach. That's usually always a gum wrapper. When you hear a six down at the bottom of the beach, that's different. Most likely a nickel, 13. 9, 12, 9, 12. 15, 15, 8, 15. 13, 14 out of the hole, that's a pull tab. Or a funny looking gray thing. between an aunt and a nephew. I'm guessing a Zinkin. No, sir. A dime. How deep that dime was. Gum wrapper. I think there's an 18 or something next to it. Solid 19. Solid 19. Funny looking gray thing. Water. 
хора. thing. screaming at me like a crazy quarter I kind of knew it wasn't a quarter what what look at the color stone in that how cool is that ring huh how cool is that man I hope that's white gold Looks like it's homemade. It's like number 30, so it's probably silver. How cool that is. It's got some markings there, whatever that means. Blackhawk, how cool is that? You know I love that. What, what? Huh? I think that's 186 for the year so far, guys. I gotta do an accurate count as I get closer to uh, 200. I can't call out 200 unless it's right. Twenty-five to twenty-nine with a chirp. You gotta like these sounds. may not be able to catch up to it. There we go. 26 through 30 out of the hole. Could easily be another ring. How about a vape? Haven't had a vape in a while. Remember it used to be like my daily thing to get a vape. That was deep. You see this slosh guys? You're not really gonna catch up to a gold ring. For the most part, it's like quicksand. Sounds like a sinka, a stinka. Oh, I should have said it sounds like a split shot. <laughs> oh, that person's never gonna. What's his name anyway? He's a noob. He's a noob. <laughs> Now this is the stuff uh, Gary Drayton would tell you not to dig. He'd say don't waste your time. Because you can dig so many more 
like think that I'll be able to go a whole nother line or two and possibly get a real target versus digging this up just wondering or curious and it really is what it is it's just I'm curious That might not have been a ring. Now, the theory behind um, not overlapping and overlapping. Somebody told me last night that I wasn't overlapping. Well, if you overlap, you're wasting your coil. If I don't overlap and I'm using 11 inches and you overlap and you're using five and a half inches, You're wasting your time. I get to cover twice as much beach while you're overlapping. Same there with the principle of digging that up. Could have been a gold ring, but the time that it took me to dig it up, I could have found two gold rings on this trip, on this, you know, on the way up. So, everybody's got their own theory about metal detecting. I will tell you if you're overlapping, you're wasting half your coil. The only time I overlap is when I'm trying to extinguish an area. Or I'm searching for something. So love for this 17. Oh wait. Seventeen and a twenty-five. Eighteen out of the hole. Most likely a penny. Or uh, I'm not sure what that is. It's got a it's got a brass thing on the top. I don't know what that is. If you guys know what that is, let me know. This was a 30, 22 to 30 with a screechy grunt and all that sound. Now it's clearing up to a quarter sound. Oh, that 
was the hardest finding quarter I've ever found, I think. Took me a minute, didn't it? Holy mackerel. What's your name? Tiffany. Tiffany, I'm Derek. Pleasure to meet you. Just say that you saw me today, met me today at the beach under tonight's video. You'll see it. Sure. Are you gonna pull one up tonight? Um, I'm gonna try. I usually try to get one up every day. Oh my gosh, that would be so neat. And you're in the perfect places. All I do is I take pictures, and then I send them to. I don't have very many family in life, but I send them to my sister and dad and my stepbrother. And he's like, you're so talented. I'm like, no, I'm just saying. It's just nature. This is all God. <laughs> I don't get any credit and I don't even have to use a filter. It's right. sick when it's this beautiful here. Right. Nice to meet you, Tiff. Nice have a good one. And I wish you all the best tonight. I appreciate I it. Yeah, this is big and this is big right here. Thank you. Nice. Have a good night. Write something good about me.